All right, welcome back again, everybody, to another episode of Dead by Daylight. I'm playing a little bit of Killer right now. We're going to be playing with the Doctor, and a really quick look at our loadout. We're going to be playing Overcharge, which is going to cause tremendously difficult skill checks after I kick the generator. Distressing, which will increase my terror radius, and Unnerving Presence, which will cause the skill check zones to get reduced by 60% and a 10% greater chance when they're in my terror radius. That, along with Nurse's Calling, I'm also running an Iridescent King to basically put my fellow players, my survivors I'll be chasing, uh, pretty much into madness and keeping them there with all the ill effects. A lot of my Doctor gameplay is based on trying to control a certain area of the map trying everything I can to protect certain generators and basically making it nearly impossible for survivors to finish those generators while I go ahead and do everything possible to pick them off slowly one by one. A lot of my doctor games turn into grinds. Uh, a lot of these games end up doing very well or they end up going very badly. There's usually never an in-between. We're going to find out what happens here. Usually if I face a team of... Uh, survive with friends when it's uh, three or four people all playing together that usually makes it more difficult because then they are very coordinated and even my bopping back from generator to generator isn't enough to keep them from getting the job done but we'll see how we do in this match a lot of it will also depend on map and we are on Cole Tower McMillan Estate for this particular matchup well, let's see how we do we're gonna go ahead immediately start checking out some generators. A generator on the second floor is not really one I'm going to want to mess with. It's probably going to be these generators maybe in the middle that are going to be most likely the ones I'm going to look to try to protect. Well, we immediately have some action over here. Not exactly a generator I wanted to mess with, but let's see what we can do. <laughs> oh, nice early hit on the Claudette here. He's going to be headed right into my favorite building. Oh. Well, that was kind of a mistake on my part. I swung a little bit too early on that one. Already getting into a bit of a long chase here, which is not exactly what my plan was. Ah, <laughs> oh, nailed with the pallet. Not good. head right back to that generator because I absolutely guarantee they're back on it. Oh, maybe they're not. Oh, there's the person we hit. Already got two generators done on me, which is not good. We're gonna go ahead and hang this Meg right here. And we are already in a very bad position. We spent way too long getting those generators done. Alright, this one's still sparking. This one doesn't look like there's any work on it. Actually, this one doesn't look like there's any work on it. <laughs> nice 
nice drop of the pallet by Nia there. Thought about chasing the Meg, but... <laughs> oh, nurse is calling, coming in handy here. In time chasing this Meg. She's leading us away from the generators, unfortunately. <laughs> oh, cannot get her. Awesome. Flashlight. Yeah, this is taking entirely too long. This game is pretty much a lost cause for us at this point. Yep. We get Meg down, but uh, unfortunately, the old adage, we win the battle, but not the war. is a well-organized team right here. Well-organized team that I'm just not going to be able to overcome, unfortunately, I don't think. Well, this generator isn't touching. Well, on the bright side... Yeah, this generator is just going to be too far away in this. Just don't think we're going to be able to make this work, unfortunately. Everybody's already healed up. Meg's been hooked twice. That generator in the killer shack, I think, is going to be too far out of our range. <laughs> the good news is this Nia is bringing me back past the generators. Pallet. We're gonna do flashlight again. Yes, we are. Oh, got her coming there. We have absolutely, positively have to be at that other generator, though. There's a crowd of people around here, apparently. There's the Claudette I saw earlier. Problem is, they've got me all on the wrong sides of the map here. There's the Bill, haven't seen him all match. <laughs> And Meg is going to go down. Thankfully, right by the hook. So we're actually going to get 
1K here. Which is honestly a little bit better than I thought we were going to do. All things considered. So they got no work going on that generator. Somebody over this direction. There's my doctor image showing up nicely for it. Well, poor Bill looks insane. All right, shack pallet goes down. We're gonna head back to the direction Bill is taking us, kind of. We know they're on this generator, so we're gonna kick that. Well, hi there, Nia. Let's get you down. You were very pesky with that flashlight earlier, so let's just drop you right there. Yeah, I see you, Claudette. Yeah, Claudette trying to body block for. Yeah, unfortunately, Claudette, you were you were injured as well. A good time to get you up on a hook and uh, give you a little taste of that. Body blocking Bill there. Didn't do you any good there, buddy. Didn't do you any good. Where'd you go? Well, oh, we know where both of them are at. They're in the vicinity, which means they're not working on generator. There goes Nia. She just ran right into those boxes. That's really unfortunate for her. And it brings us right back over here to the shack. We know where Bill is at. Yep, see a, see a healing over there, Claudette. Now, oh, Claudette. That's Nia getting off the hook. That's fine. No build a body block this time for you. That's your second hook. Question is, did they get back on that shack generator? Oh, well, there's Bill. Hey, Bill, how you doing? Let's go, Nia. Oh, <laughs> well, Nia, that is going to be the end of your night. Stop crawling. Oh, your crawling is getting under my nerves, Nia. Well, Claudette is healed. Bill's been the pesky one. This Nia is dead. That generator is toast. And we are recovering pretty well from what was a pretty 
ugly situation there for a little while. None of these three gens have any work on it. Yep, Bill, you've been getting on my nerves. And we lost him. No, we didn't. Oh, you're coughing and wheezing there, buddy. There you are, Bill. Let's just break this pal and get this out of our way. See, the problem they have is they're both on this side of the map. Yep, there's Claudette trying to get back to this generator. It's just not working. That flashlight's not going to help you, Claudette. This would be very good for us if we could put her away now. Yep. Oh, have a seat, Claudette. Have a seat. Hook right here for you. And that's three down. So the only question is, where is Bill? And does Bill know where the hatch is? We'll take a 3K on this game. Oh, there goes Bill. Oh, Bill didn't know where the hatch was. Well, all things considered, not too bad. We got off to a pretty rocky start there. We've found a survivor early. We wasted a little bit of time trying to hunt him down, but in the end, not too shabby a game. Three out of 4K, Bill knew where the hatch was. And that did save him. But all things considered, a, a pretty, pretty solid game for me. Uh, Mid-ranked players, again, I'm guessing at least two or three of them were in the lobby together with one another. Uh, the bill might actually have been the one who wasn't. But in the end, uh, a 3K game, we'll go ahead and take that any day of the week uh, with the doctor and this particularly annoying build to play with. So uh, more games coming up, more killer rounds coming up on the channel. Uh, we're going to try to move away uh, just exclusively from playing the doctor. That's the character I seem to have the most success with. It's the one I know the best. I do play other ones. I certainly don't do that well with them, as you're going to find out if you see any more of my killer videos in the future. But in the meantime, if you've stayed around this long, please hit the like and subscribe buttons. Hit the bell for notifications when we put out new videos, which is pretty much every day at this point. And thanks again for watching, and hope everyone is well. Thank you again.